हेलो स्टूडेंट्स नाउ विल स्टार्ट विद आर टॉपिक सर्कुलेशन ऑफ ब्लड इन द हार्ट टिल नाउ वी हैव रेड अबाउट द स्ट्रक्चर ऑफ द हार्ट डिफरेंट ब्लड वेसल्स दैट एंटर एंड लीव द हार्ट देन द वॉल्स दैट आर प्रेजेंट इन साइड द हार्ट नाउ टुडे वी विल लर्न हाउ द ब्लड बेसिकली सर्कुलेट्स इन साइड द हार्ट सो वेल द प्रोसेस इट बिगिन्स वेन द टू ऑरिकल्स दे कॉन्ट्रैक्ट वेन द ऑरिकल्स आर कॉन्ट्रैक्टिंग see the ventricles they are in a relaxed state and they are empty they are not having anything in it so the auricles they contract and when they contract these valves the tricuspid valve and the bicuspid valve they get open and the blood from both these auricles enters into the respective ventricles after this the valves the bicuspid and the tricuspid they get closed now the blood is present in the ventricles this is the time now the ventricles they will contract the ventricles then contract from the right ventricle blood goes into your pulmonary artery this is the diagram this time i have shown the pulmonary artery upside it is going till now we were going through the simplified diagram of the heart but now as of now you might have understood the diagram the uh, places where the different parts are placed inside the heart i forgot to um, mark it actually see this is the aorta these are the pulmonary veins this is left auricle this is left ventricle now this is pulmonary artery these are vena cava this is right ventricle sorry right auricle and this is right ventricle sorry i forgot now once the ventricles they contract now blood from this right ventricle it goes into the pulmonary artery we have discussed that this blood will go to the lungs for oxygenation and blood from this left ventricle it goes into the aorta which valves are present here here it is aortic semilunar valve and here it is pulmonary semilunar valves so the valves they get open this time see when the ventricles contract we do not want the blood to enter back into the auricles so these cordae tendini they keep these flaps intact in their position no other place is left when the ventricles contract there is no other place left where the blood can go so the these pocket shaped semilunar valves they open and they get the blood from their respective ventricles once the blood is flown from uh, pushed out from these ventricles after this the ventricles they relax when they relax the blood which is present here in these blood vessels it just comes back when it comes back the pockets shaped these uh, semilunar valves they get filled with the pockets and then they get closed in the previous video we have shown how it looks when they get closed so this is all about the circulation of blood in the heart a uh, one point more that i want to add the auricles they are getting blood from their respective blood vessels left auricle getting oxygenated blood from the lungs with the help of the pulmonary vein and the deoxygenated blood from all of our body from the vena cava i have drawn just one the anterior one which is getting the blood from the upper portion of our body and the posterior vena cava which gets the blood from the lower region of our body so this video tells us the circulation of blood in the heart thank you